Hello friends, this is Carla from Mountain Spirit Yoga, here to check in with each one of you to see how you are doing. I hope you've been able to get outside some the last couple of days and spend some time breathing that fresh air, getting some good exercise, um, noticing all the signs of spring around you. Every day there's something new to see and to hear birds singing, incredible birds singing. It's really windy right now. I hear a lot of wind ch chimes outside. And um, just hope that you're doing some connecting with nature. As I wrote in the newsletter last week, this is a time when you can really connect deeply with nature um, to really feel that sense of stability and groundedness that comes from being in nature. And it's also a time of going inside and connecting with yourself or perhaps with your family, maybe your pets or your, uh, your deep longings, your favorite interests, you know, whatever and however you're using this time. So I wanted to offer a meditation for you to feel connected to each other. Because I'm really missing you guys and I, I just want to know how you are and I want to know that you are all well and safe and that you still feel so connected. Um, I think that's one of the wonderful parts about our community at Mountain Spirit Yoga that we all feel very connected to each other. So this meditation is for that. We'll be using two different mudras in the meditation. And I'll show you each of them first before we start. Because of the way this videotaping works, my hands look humongous when I bring them up, but I just want to show you so you can see them. The first mudra is Hakini, and Hakini mudra is all 10 fingertips together, and they create a loose open weave basket that you then point so the fingertips are forward and they're either right there at your solar plexus, just below your breastbone, or resting comfortably in your lap. So that'll be the first one that we'll be using. And then towards the end of the meditation, <clears throat> I'll have you bring your hands up into Anjali Mudra, as we typically would, but then to pull apart the middle knuckles so that the sides of the thumbs come together. And this is a Dove of Peace Mudra, and this will be held at your heart. So as you are ready, let's settle in, um, sitting tall, making sure that your sits bones are grounded on whatever you're sitting on, uh, maybe wiggle a bit to get them to evenly settle, and then have a long spine lifting up from those sits bones reaching up towards the sky. You're welcome to keep your eyes open or close them or just softly close them whatever feels most comfortable for you. I'll probably be doing a little bit of all of that. So there's really nothing to look at uh, if you want to instead use this time to go within. So sitting comfortably, having your sits bones rooted, take a full breath in through your nose and softly let it out with a sigh. Try that again. Maybe lift your shoulders up on the in-breath. And as you exhale, let all of the stress and tension, ah, whatever is accumulated in your neck and shoulders, let it softly settle. And try that one more time. And this time, perhaps add a roll of the shoulders, letting those worries and responsibilities roll right off your back. Then with eyes either closed or open or however you're comfortable, bring your hands into Hakini Mudra. <clears throat> so that's that one where the fingertips are touching, but there's an open space like an open basket between the palms. Fingertips are facing forward and you're holding that gesture either right in front of your solar plexus or arms comfortably resting on your lap. Tune your awareness to your breath. <clears throat> As you inhale, feel lengthening upward of the spine. 
And as you exhale, send energy rooting down through those sits bones right into the heart of the earth so that you feel that strength, that stability, that sense of security. On the in-breath, you draw from that well of the earth all the way up the length of your spine, up to the crown of your head, and maybe even reaching above the crown of your head up into space. And then as you exhale, send that energy down back into the earth. Following your breath, following this rise and fall of energy, connecting you along your center spine to the earth, to the sky. And the next time you are inhaling, connecting with the sun, and on the exhale, draw down golden rays of light to shower around the outside of your body. Inhale, rising up through the center of your spine. And on the exhale, drawing down those golden rays of light. Try that one more time. Earth energy rising on the in-breath and golden light from the sun flowing around you on the out-breath. And then take another deep breath in. And as you exhale, draw that golden light down through the crown of your head, all the way down to your solar plexus. And there at the solar plexus, begin to expand your breath inhaling, opening in all directions, and as you exhale, drawing back into your center. Inhaling, expanding that golden radiant light in all directions, and as you exhale, drawing back into your center. That Hikini Mudra is a mudra of connection, a mudra of integration. And as you breathe this golden light, imagine it going out to other people, perhaps in your family, perhaps in your community, perhaps in our Mountain Spirit Yoga community. And then as you exhale, draw them all down into yourself. Continue to breathe this golden light energy outward and then into yourself until you feel completely filled with radiance. And then bring your palms together at your heart in Anjali Mudra. And in Anjali Mudra, palm to palm, gently pull the knuckles apart the thumbs will come together and into the center. And imagine all of those people that you sent that radiant light energy out to, that they are receiving that light and sending that light back to you, all of that energy from your heart to their heart and back to your heart once more. Breathing into that gathered light energy at your heart. And here, wishing them all to be well, to be strong, to be healthy, to be at ease in their mind and heart, and to feel connected to each other. Honoring that connection, that heart-to-heart -heart light sharing, let's join all our hearts together and chant Om. Take a full breath in.
honoring the light, honoring the love, honoring the radiance of your own heart. Namaste. Thank you, friends, for joining me for this short meditation. I hope you feel a little bit more connected. I know I feel my heart brimming with all of you. And look forward to more moments of connection with you through video in the coming days. Namaste. Be well.